Hey guys, so a couple weeks ago at this workshop that I helped run, we were making handmade Christmas cards. So I made a few little easy Christmas themed illustrations to bring in as examples. And I thought, why not film it just in case someone else might want to have a look at it, get a little bit of inspiration um, so they can make some illustrations maybe for decorations or if they want to make their own handmade cards. I thought it might be a cute idea. So I just put together this really short video of me doing these illustrations. Each of the illustrations probably took like about five to ten minutes, not including drying time. So I, th I think they'd be fairly easy for most people to do. So I'll just do a super quick rundown of how I did them. This first little antler illustration, if you don't feel comfortable freehanding it, you can just trace the antler shapes. Paint a few little circles for baubles, maybe do some white and yellow for string likes if you want to do that. You can make them a bit more complicated if you want to do patterns on the baubles. And then just um, black paint to collect, connect the antlers in little strings so it looks like the antlers have been wrapped in baubles and lights and strings. The second illustration is some winter foliage, it's pretty easy, just lay down some flat leaf shapes and then you can use a different shade of green to add some dimension and shading, then you can just add some red circles for berries and that's pretty much it. This one is a little polar bear wrapped in a scarf, I thought it was really cute. So I just put um, some cool grey tones just to add a little bit of shading to the fur. Um, I did it pretty loose and random, I didn't really worry too much about making it neat and perfect. And then I just added um, line in pen afterwards to give it some form and shape. I also didn't worry too much about the red of the scarf bleeding in because I was going to add pen later. You can make it as simple or detailed as you want in terms of the line work, so it depends on your um, drawing ability. This wreath is also pretty easy to do, just lay down some basic leaf shapes, then keep adding to it, going darker and darker, varying up the shape of the leaves. As well as the colours, you could also add things like pine cones, berries, little twigs, whatever you fancy. This is the kind of thing where you don't need to be super detailed with it because it's pretty recognisable even when you do it very loose.
and this last one, a little gingerbread man, is really easy. Just paint down a flat wash of a kind of warm brown orangey colour in the shape of a gingerbread man. Then once that's dry, you can go over the edges and do kind of a crummy texture with a darker um, toned version of that. And we can add details like the little buttons, um, the face. I used a black pen just to make it easier, but you could also use white paint maybe to do some icing decorations. I think that would look really nice. So I was really brief with my explanations for how I made these, but I still hope it gave um, you some inspiration for some little Christmas or winter themed illustrations you might want to make. Anyway, I'm off, so see you later. Bye!